Hi, this is a quick video demonstrating how to assign online remote class links with your classes and share them with your customers. We're going to start off in Zoom. Zoom is a very popular video conferencing tool that is used by many of our clients to perform remote classes online. You don't have to use Zoom, you can use whatever tool you like. After you schedule a remote meeting, you get a joining URL. What you need to do is copy this URL to the clipboard. Then in your biz product, what you need to do is edit the class you want to assign the remote class to. Come down to class options and hit remote class information. What you need to do is checkbox enable remote class. This will flag the class as being a remote class. Then you want to paste your URL into the conferencing link field. Next, you may want to set a link expiry. This expiry tells the software that the link will no longer be valid after this date and time. You also have the option to put in a description. Simply hit OK and OK again. There are two ways you can share this remote class link with your customers, either through the customer portal or via our emailing system. First, I'll show you how to email them out. When you send an email, you can include class table tags. These tags list all the classes that the recipient's students are doing. In this example here, the recipient will receive an email similar to this. If the customer had multiple students doing classes, then multiple classes would be listed. If a class is a remote class, a remote class link will be shown at the bottom. This, of course, is the link we provided earlier. In addition, we have a filter for students that are in remote classes. This will easily allow you to send emails to only customers that have students in remote classes. If you utilise the customer portal and your customers are viewing their students' class enrolment details, they'll see a remote class button below the class. Pressing this button will open a new tab in your customer's browser and link them to the remote conference link. Your customers can also view the link by clicking on the view details button and seeing the link with the description there. If you want to view an entire list of your class's remote class details, you can run a classes export. Along with all of your class's attributes, this export includes three additional columns, the remote class link, the link expiry, and the link description. This will be handy for reporting on which classes have been set up as remote classes and also for tracking their expiries. Thanks for watching and as always please contact us if you have any questions. All the best.